don't miss it. Russia is the highest producer of nuclear weapons. Yet they couldn't use their nuclear weapons during their war with Ukraine. That is because there is an international law that regulates the production, testing, and launching of climate change. <laughs> and besides, when was the last time we heard of nuclear weapons being used? That was way back 1945 in Hiroshima in Japan. So, sweetheart, your argument is neither here nor there. Join us at the quarterfinal stage of the Love FM High School debate at the Christian Service University College at two. PM. The chair of the house, please permit me to rebut certain fallacies made by my opponents here. My opponents, I'm very glad you talked about nuclear weapons. Well, when military bases are testing their nuclear weapons, the seas and the oceans are their first targets. And according to Archimedes' principle, it states that when an object is immersed in a liquid, it observes an upthrust which is equal to the weight of water displaced. Please observe. Rally behind your alma mater in the quarterfinal stage of the Love FM High School's debate. Point two, publishing the asset of all public officials provides legal grounds for detecting, investigating, and sanctioning corrupt public officials. Legal processes are important in all jurisdictions in the structure of the anti-corruption effort. Transparency International knows that asset publishing not only proves essential in the detection and prevention of corruption among public officials, but also in their investigation and sanction where necessary. Come hail your alma mater to glory at the Christian Service University College. It's the Love FM High School debate. Don't miss it. Motion is climate change is the greatest threat. You mentioned AI, you mentioned nuclear weapons, pandemics, and a whole lot. Sweetheart, which one of them is the greatest? We'll be waiting for the response. Join us at the quarterfinal stage of the Love FM High School debate at the Christian Service University College at 2 p.m. Come hail your alma mater to glory at the Christian Service University College. It's the Love FM High School debate. Don't miss it. The chair of the house, please permit me to rebut certain fallacies made by my opponents here. My opponents, I'm very glad you talked about nuclear weapons. Well, when military bases are testing their nuclear weapons, the seas and the oceans are their first targets. And according to Archimedes' principle... We would like to say thank you so much for joining us on the fifth edition of the Love FM High School's debate. We are also live on radio on Love 99.5 FM and also on social media LUV99.5 FM. Welcome to the semi-final stage of the Love FM High School's debate happening here at the Christian Service University College in Kumase. My name is Patricia Amabonsu. On and on, we started from the round of 16. We went through to the quarterfinal stage and today is the day we sit in contest one of the semi-final stage of the Love FM High School's debate. And today, the contest is going to be between first-time winners, that is, um, the winners of the maiden edition of this particular debate, that is T.I. Amadia Kumase, and also... Presek Bompata, and today they are going to argue for and against the motion code. Chiefs should be blamed solely for illegal mining Galamse in Ghana on code. We have Presek Bompata arguing for the motion and T.I. Mas arguing against the motion. Do remember that we do the Love FM High School's debate in collaboration with the Ghana Education Service, the Ashanti Regional Students Representative Council, that is the ARSRC. We also have the Conference of Heads of Assisted Senior High Schools, the Writers and Debaters Society. Society, as well as Joy Prime and Joy Learning, and of course, our amazing sponsors. We'd like to say thank you to all of them. And remember also that we are live still on Joy Learning TV, on Joy Prime, and also on Love 99.5 FM. And so you do need to stay tuned. And with the hashtag LUVFMHSD, you can send us your comments on Facebook. Like we always do, we are here to find out from them how prepared the two schools are for today. So we can now have our patrons or our teachers from the schools to have a conversation with us and we see the game plan, what they are bringing on board today. And so I'm going to start off with a gentleman on my right here. He has um, a mass phobia um, scarf around his neck. So I presume you are from um, TI Amas, right? Yes, please. I'm from TI Amas. And you are live on Joy and Love 99.5 FM as well as Joy Prime. Let us find out from you your name and what we should expect from your school today. I'm Kennedy Kafui Kumafo, popularly known as Misue Kafui from TIMS. And I believe that today is going to be a contest of our lives. We won it for the first time, and for the fifth time this contest is running, we are taking the trophy home again. And way back in our school, the Global Amas, all the teachers, the students, everything behind EI Amas. Our last contest, we had 
a mark of 232 um, two, as um, the percentage was 50.43. Today, we are not going to get anything lower than 250. We could hear some people making noise when we came here. As the saying goes, empty barrels make the most noise. We are here calmly going to win this contest. And I believe that everybody is supporting us. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kafu. He is not even thinking of the semifinals. He's thinking of the finals already. But let me move to um, the gentleman also here on my left to find out what he has also, what his school is bringing today. You are live on Joy Learning, Joy Prime, and Love 99.5 FM. Introduce yourself to us and let us see what you are also bringing on board today. Thank you very much, Patricia. My name is Dijoy Amankwa, the trainer for Presec Bompata. Actually, history is going to be made again because we met TIMAS last two years during the prelims. We took them out and we are coming to make history again. Um, this is a contest. This is a debate contest. It is not a theater center. So um, TIMAS should take note and follow suit. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, DeJoy and Kafui, for joining us. We can now speak to our students or our supporters from the two schools to find out whether they are going to even depart from what their teachers or their patrons have said so far. So I'm just going to continue from um, TI and Mass. And you heard your patron and you heard the opposition. What would you want to say? I'm Hamza Samatim Tony from TI and Mass, a debater from TI and Mass. First of all, Presak Bompata should realize that we were the median champions of this competition. And this year is actually our year because this year we are going to the finals and we're actually going to take that, that greatness to our school. They should realize that because we have kicked out many teams like Yaks and Kumasi High. And today, nothing can stop us from kicking them out. Thank you. Okay, thank you so much, Sam. Let me speak to this gentleman also from Real Amaz. What would you want to add? I'm Kofi Beidou, a member of the debate team. And all I would say is... Um, just like my colleagues say, we're the maiden champions of the event. And we promise that, we won't even think of this same, we're talking about finals. We are going to be the very first ever two times live from high school debate winners. And all I would say is, our debaters, as the Bible says, power, he gives us power against our enemies. Your, the debaters already have their power. And Presec, they should be ready, because we came. They are just waiting to deliver, so they, they just should be ready. I see. Thank you so much, T.I. Amas. Let me speak to also the students coming from Presec Bompata. And you've heard your colleagues over there. What would you want to tell them? Okay, Mr. Patricia, thank you very much for giving me such opportunity. My name is Enchi Boisaki Eugene, the assistant head prefect of Presec Bompata. At Camp 4, as our name goes and we respond, we started, has been our major driving force since the earliest beginning of this competition. And we want to tell our mass to take a grip. They should stand firm because the shock that they are going to receive today will be the biggest shock in their life. Eddie Camfor. Eddie Camfor. Eddie Camfor. Thank you. Thank you so much, um, Eugene. Let me speak finally to this beautiful lady also from Presec Bompata. What would you want to share with us? Okay, I'm Heroya Grace Fatmata Mohammed, the WDS president of four, Presbyterian Senior High School Bompata. And my message is just simple. As quoted in Psalm 125, which says, Those who trust in the Lord are like Mount Zion. Today, we trust in the Lord. See, i saying that they were the defending champions. They should notice that Saul was a champion, but David kept him out. So today, we are going to kick them out. We are winning. Presec B. Okay, so David Aquetta is on standby right now in the auditorium at the Christian Service University College. And so we are going to cross over to him. But do remember that you need to join us on our Facebook with the hashtag LUVFMHSD. My name is Patricia. We'll be back with more on the Love FM High School's debate. Don't go anywhere. And indeed, it's very obvious that you enjoyed that engagement. Patricia had with patrons yes. and students of both schools. So a round of applause for the patrons and the students that spoke to Patricia Amabonsu at the foyer at the Christian Service University College. You know something? I'm excited and I am sad at the same time. I'm sad because come Friday the 14th of July, we'll draw down the curtain of the 2023 edition of the Love FM High School Debate. It's been exciting, it's been informative, it's been educative. If you've enjoyed yourself as much as I have, a round of applause for all the participating schools and all the debaters that came through this beautiful auditorium, mounted this beautiful platform, picked up the microphone and debated. For your information, this afternoon we'll be witnessing the very first contest in the semi-final edition. 
And because of the importance of it, we are live on Joy Prime on Multi TV. Already we've been on Joy Learning since its inception. We're live on radio on Love 19.5. Also live on Facebook on LUV 19.5. For those of you who join us on Facebook, you know the drill already. Pick up your phones or any device you have and then drop comments on Facebook. This afternoon's contest is going to be between Presec Bompata and T.I. Amas. And like Patricia said, the motion for this afternoon is chiefs should be blamed solely for illegal mining. That is Galamse in Ghana. Now, Presec Bompata, they are for the motion and T.I. Amas against, uh, against the motion. We'd like to say a big thank you to our host, the Christian Service University College. Please, a round of applause for them, for the love. And for making the auditorium available for us for this afternoon's contest, just like we've been doing since uh, the inception of the program. We'd also like to say a big thank you to the Ashanti Regional GES. A round of applause for the GES of Ashanti. <laughs> to the Conference of Heads of our Sister Secretary Schools, that is CHAS. To the Ashanti Regional Representative Council. And of course, the Writers and Debater Society. Make some noise for all of them. Thank you very much. And a round of applause for your own selves for making time to be with us in this auditorium as well. Good to see you. You're looking handsome. You're looking beautiful. You're looking gorgeous. Now, I'd like to inform you that this afternoon, our chairperson, and of course, she is the ambassador for the Love FM High School debate. She is in our midst. Mrs. Theresa Jackson is the name. And she's an, she's an esteemed educator and the former headmistress of KNUSD. That is a JHS. Now, she's also known as a co-founder of Jackson Educational Complex. Mrs. Jackson has dedicated her entire life to providing quality education and shaping the minds of young learners. Overall, Mrs. Theresa Jackson's accomplishments and dedication to education makes her an inspiring figure in the field of education. Her passion for shaping young minds and creating opportunities for learning is truly commendable. Ladies and gentlemen, please a round of applause for her. And I'd like to invite her to mount the podium. We give her about a minute as our chairperson to speak to us. Show her some love, please. The applause is a bit on the low side. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. I appreciate all of you. And I congratulate you for coming this far. I know you have put in a lot of efforts in searching for information. Our debaters, take it cool. Don't panic. Be yourself and deliver. The rest of us, let us give them the needed support. We don't have to make noise when we don't have to. Let's comply with the rules and the regulations and may the best school win. Thank you. In this simple and straight to the point, we can do better with the applause. Or you want me to buy the applause from you? How much is an applause? I'll pay for it. If you want to give it to me for free, please put your hands together when you're asked to, okay? Thank you so much. Now, we're doing this together with some partners. We'd like to acknowledge their support and, of course, uh, their love for the Love FM High School debate. One of them is Pepsodent. Now, Pepsodent Herbal is on the market. It is formulated from carefully selected natural extracts and uniquely blended herbs. Pepsodent Herbal repairs and protects gum tissue whilst giving you strong teeth for you to be able to chew your matting and, of course, crack the bones as, as well. Pepsodent Charcoal White is also on the market. Some of us, we have yellowish teeth and brownish teeth and all that. Pepsodent Charcoal White is made with a fine blend of activated charcoal and lemon essence. Pepsodent Charcoal White polishes away tooth stains and naturally restores your bright smile. Make your smile count with any of Pepsodent's brands on the market. Pepsodent, every smile indeed matters. Rasta Choco Malt is also a partner. We are proud to have them on board. Introducing the all-new Rasta Choco Malt, a feel of real chocolate malt, sorghum and caramel with the right amount of herbs. Your best bet for your favorite cho uh, chocolate malt drink is Rasta Choco Malt. Grab a bottle of Rasta Choco Malt with a new look and the same great taste at any supermarket. Rasta Choco Malt is proudly made in Ghana by Chilliam Industrial Company Limited. Let's now talk about Jackson Education College. They are presenting the teacher professional examination preparation tuition. This is the final licensure exam for the current curriculum and the final opportunity for DBE graduates to write the licensure exams. So you don't need to miss out at all. Don't miss out. 
Between August 12 to October 28, 2023, they hold online classes on Microsoft Teams every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. The rate is the cool 300 Ghana cities. Call 0545-051188 or 0544-261820 to register today. Jackson Education College Practicality, Employability, Quality. Now, Carbell indeed, as you will all know, is our milk. It's from Promacidor Ghana Limited, and never forget when it comes to milk enjoyment, it is Cowbell, which of course is our milk. Madam Catherine has a physiotherapy unit, an eye care center, general clinic services, laboratory, 3G ultrasound, non-linear uh, systems, radionics, and many more. Madam Catherine Blood Tonic is recommended for ladies with menstrual pains and individuals with low blood or recovering from an illness. Locate Madam Catherine here in Kumasi. They are at Bodhi Junction. Fortune Rice and Frital is also one of our sponsors. It is from Wilma. I want you to enjoy mouth-watering you know, dishes with Frital, a vitamin A fortified oil that promotes good vision. With Frital, all your spicy fried chicken and chips, your jollof and fried goat meat, and that shrimp fried rice just got better. Welcome friends and family to that feast prepared with Frital and taste the crunchiness of every bite. Remember, with Frital, every mealtime is a memorable party time. Frital, you deserve a life of goodness. Christian Service University College is also one of our very affectionate partners. September admissions is in progress. They want me to tell you. So apply now. Undergraduate programs include BA Theology with Administration, BA Communication Studies with Options in Public Relations, Print Journalism and Broadcast Journalism as well as Advertising. They also have BA Planning and Development, BBA Banking and Finance, BBA Marketing, BBA Human Resource Management, BSc Nursing, BSc Midwifery, BSc Computer Science, BSc Information Technology and postgraduate programs include MA Christian Ministry with Management, MA and MPhil Communication Studies plus so much more. A round of applause for our partners please. Have you run through them? Well, we have more to share with you. And Patricia, I like your hairstyle this afternoon. Thank you so You're much, You're looking David. gorgeous. And so, Darcy and Becca also look gorgeous. So, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome them warmly with a round of applause as they share some more information with us. Sure, definitely. And we are here to share more information. We'd like to say thank you to Zest Consult, the leading IELTS and SAT tuition center in Ghana. Now, IELTS helps nurses and health workers to work or study in the UK, Europe, and other countries, whereas SAT also helps students to study in the USA, Canada, and other countries for their undergraduate degree. Now, if you want to study abroad at any level of scholarship, come to Zest Consult for the best guidance and assistance. Zest Consult is also now into the sale and buying of litigation free land and buildings. And so they will sort out all your real estate issues. Consult uh, or go to Zest Consult today, located in Kumase, at the Kumase Cultural Center and also DHM to Main 5 in the Wilder Stars. We say a very big thank you to Academic City University College. Get into the digital transformational world by enrolling at the premium world-class institution for science, technology, engineering, arts, and mathematics education. Academic City University College. Develop your entrepreneurial and leadership niche at the first university in Africa to offer a degree in artificial intelligence and robotics engineering. You can register after this, uh, this uh, contest at uh, act.edu.gh. We'd like to say also thank you to Otiasika Rob Bank, the bank that takes away your poverty. They are operating current savings, fixed deposit, SUSU, and infant savings account for your child's future. Now, they also give SUSU business, funeral, micro, and group loans, and as well as salary loans with the lowest interest ever on the market. We also have to get you your Western Union, eSwitch, iTrans, mobile money, Ghana Pay, and everything that is electronic from Otiasika Rob Bank. Visit any of our branches today in the Ashanti region. Our headquarters is at Kofiase, but we have branches at Mampong, Edra, Sipebokrom, Abofo, Makro, and Kenkenso, Swami Market, and also Dr. Mensa inside the Lansa Chemist Building. Otiasika Rob Bank, your savior in Rob Banking. We also say thank you to Grace Gift Herbal Clinic, specialist in the treatment of stroke, diabetes, hypertension, prostate cancer, fibroids, skin infections, and sexual health issues. Our experience uh, staff and ultra modern medical diagnostic equipment present you with solutions that will help restore the quality of your life. Locators in Kumase at Ohum School Junction off the Barikasi Road. Pidato Limited Company located at 
Atonsu S line here in Kumase and making sure that you make a mark in the IT career world. Now we also offer software and website development, graphic design, social media management, consultation for business documentation and certification, data collection and data analysis research services. We also highly recommend that you run your CPD programs at Pidato because they have an education subsidiary. Pidato Limited Company, innovations, solutions and empowering growth. And is your car experiencing electrical or mechanical faults? Do you want your air conditioners repaired at the best price? Then visit Kumasi Auto Detail. Our experienced engineers provide you with quality general repairs, injection services, tire services, engine and gearbox management, vacuuming, AC gas refilling, flushing, and computer diagnostics. We order and deliver your car parts. If they are not available in the country, we deliver your car parts from outside within one week. So relax and watch your car being fixed on CCTV at our serene reception. Locate Kumase Auto Detail opposite Unity Oil, Malcolm Road, Davan, next to Innes Hybrid School. Dear students, are we still sleeping in our mosquito nets or we have stopped? Please show by hands. Mosquito nets. If you have a mosquito net at school, please, you, let me see you. Hey. Sikana <laughs> Love FM, we got it. And if it is your desire to start your own business, then New Life Entrepreneurship Training Center is here for you. We train Ghanaians with entrepreneurial mindset and skills to establish businesses. We run short-term, medium, and long-term courses on entrepreneurship, skills development, and general education. Admission is currently open for our regular evening and weekend classes at an affordable fee. You can locate us opposite Love and Insure FM at the Bomso Traffic Lights right here in Kumasi. And after you take your trauma term tablets, you will definitely need to also replenish and also get your energy back. One way you can get your energy back is involving or inculcating into your breakfast top choco. Please, have you all seen this? Have you all seen this very beautiful package product? Yes, this is top choco spread on bread. We also have the top choco um, three in one chocolate drink. If you want it hot, you just add hot water. If you want it cold, you just add um, cold water. Now, the thing is that they've actually combined or produced top choco products with the finest blend of cocoa, milk, and sugar produced right here in this country. And so you know that you are tasting Ghanaian excellence if you settle for anything from top choco. Know that top choco is available in any supermarket market closer to you. Top Choco, it is Chocolati. We also say thank you to Dawood Herbal presenting Dow 360 capsules for the treatment of waist pains and rheumatism. Dawood ointment is also good for the treatment of joint pains, general body pains, rheumatism and waist pains. You can combine both for quick relief and Dawood Herbal products are certified by the FDA and are available in all pharmacies and herbal shops across the country. Well, before David takes over, I would like to say congratulations to all students, yes, WASI students, especially those who passed their economics and government, because we understand that they used One Touch Publications to achieve that. And so, if you're a student watching me or listening to me, and you are also in this auditorium, and you've not gotten yourself One Touch Publications, um, government and economics book, I can say for sure, say, oh yeah, yo, what's in Eba? Go and get yourself One Touch Publications. They have the economic economics textbooks and also the past questions as well for the government. You can find it in any bookshop nationwide and know that it has been approved by NACA. So on that note, we're inviting David again to the stage, but do remember we are live on TV on Joy Prime, Joy Learning on Radio on Love 99.5 FM and also on social media. The hashtag remains LUVFM HSD. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Please a round of applause for Becca. And Patricia, thanks very much. You'll be hearing from them again shortly. And one of the most inter interesting things they do is for them to bring to us comments from Facebook. They share with us what people are saying about the debate on Facebook. And they'll be joining us one more time in a bit. Amasphobia! 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 Do you want me to go on? One more time. Amasphobia! 
That's the energy I'm looking for. Put your hands together for yourselves. For information, we are live on television. Two channels, Joy Learning, Joy Prime on Multi TV. So if you're watching us, well, we're coming to you from the Christian Service University Colleges Auditorium here in Kumasi, where we're bringing to you the very first semi-final contest in the 2023 edition of the Love FM High School Debates. We're also live on radio on Love 99.5. And of course, on Facebook, it's on LUV 99.5 FM. Join us there on Facebook. Drop comments. Let's reach out to those comments and read them. Ladies and gentlemen, in about 15 minutes, debaters will start to debate. You know the rules of engagement, so be guided. I'd like at this point in time to you know, say a big good afternoon to a panel of judges. Some of you are new, so you might not know them, so I'd like to introduce them to you so you can know who they are. After the introduction of the judges, our lead judge will grab the microphone and run us through the rules of engagement. Be, 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 be you know, attentive. Listen to him attentively as he runs us through the rules of engagement because that would also aid you to understand what we're looking for and you can tell us whether the debaters are online or offline. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you a judge. She's a female judge. She goes by the name Dr. Mrs. Beatrice Akusia. Sorry, Bonku. And uh, sorry, Dr. Bonku has taught for over 30 years. She's with the KSTU. And she's still in active service, even well after 30 years in service. Ladies and gentlemen, please, a round of applause for her. And if you want to find her, she is with the Liberal Studies Department at KSTU. That's where you can find her. And Professor Osei Fosu is also with us. Now, many refer to him as OFAG. He is also one of our judges. Ladies and gentlemen, please, a round of applause for him as well. And um, not forgetting our lead judge, Dr. Peter Arthur. He's with the Department of English here in University. He's a former head of the Department of Ling English and former head of the Department of Languages and Communication Sciences. Ladies and gentlemen, please, a round of applause for our lead judge, Dr. Peter Arthur. And I like the way he waves. So, Doc, you know the drill already. Once I introduce you, you take a few minutes, like four or five minutes, run us through the rules of engagement. So, we appreciate what you guys as judges will be doing. Please, one more time, show him some love, Dr. Peter Arthur. Thank you, Dave. Yes, uh, this is the semifinals of the competition, and it's getting hotter and hotter. So my duty here is to tell you the criteria we use in judging the debaters. Note that we have made certain changes. The first one being the duration. Formerly, it used to be seven minutes for the first speaker. We've moved it to 10 minutes. Second speaker, it used to be five minutes. We've moved it to seven minutes. And then the third speaker, or the summary, sorry. The summary used to be three, it's gone to five. Then the second change has got to do with number of points needed and please pay attention here. First speaker, five points. Some of you like winding. You wind, 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 and give us three or four points, please. Make sure today you give us five points. Second speaker, three points. Then the next thing has got to do with the decision. We no more take what we call the highest score, not necessarily. We have three judges. If two score for a school, that school wins. And that is what we call majority decision. If the three score for a school, that school automatically wins. And that is what we call unanimous decision. It could be controversial, but think about it carefully. It was made so that we could always have, you no, know, we are human beings and there could be excesses so that if we have that, then at least whoever is having that kind of problem, it can be checked. Then now, uh, there is an introduction. After the collection of the marks, one who is doing the collection will come to us, and we will verify and make sure that the marks that we give to the, candidate, the, the, the debaters 
are exactly the marks that are going to be announced. Now we come to the various categories that we use in Georgia. We have the organization and clarity. And here, good introduction, good development, good conclusion. And each of them is scoring one point. So three times five, 15. For the first speaker, second speaker, three times three, nine plus one, 10. For the second speaker, and then the summary is five. Argument and development.